go down, right? And this section over here that says it's not possible, y'all made it impossible, right? He started, I'm just kidding. He started to sink through the water. And what could he do next? Lord, save me. What happened next? Immediately, Jesus stretched out his hand and caught him and raised him back up and said to him, Oh, you of little faith, why did you doubt? Why did you doubt? Man, what an experience that would have been to walk on water that day with Jesus. Just to be able to stand there, right? And the prideful person I am, I would have had to look back at the other disciples and said, Told you so. I told you so. So they were always making fun of Peter like that. You know, he was always the one that was trying to do those things. He always put his foot in his mouth. He was always, I can always relate to Peter, by the way. So here Jesus came walking on the water. Peter gets out there, walks on water. But the first sign of a disturbance, of a distraction, Peter's faith failed. He began to worry. He was looking at things that were going on around him, and he began to sink. But Jesus was there to save him and raised him up. Amen? Now, I want to teach you today three spiritual techniques. But before I get into these three spiritual techniques, I think it's important to know why do we have spiritual techniques? What is a spiritual technique? Now, if, if I were to ask you what is the difference between a high school baseball player and a professional baseball player the number one thing that would come to mind is well the professionals better right he's got more experience but actually the difference is a professional baseball player has mastered basic techniques and in baseball Tim help me out I knew you'd come back up here y'all may not know this about Tim but Tim Tim is a, no, see, no, I'm holding the bat, I'm holding the bat. Y'all may not know this about Tim, but Tim played college baseball. Tim, <laughs> stick with me here, stick with me. So Tim uh, is a, it was, I'm scared to put this in your hand, I'm scared. Tim knows a lot of techniques about baseball. He played in high school, he played in college, and played professionally last week. last week. All right. So there are a few things, and we kind of talk 